how has this affected you financially? If I'm not mistaken, <laughs> you're. Um, <laughs> are, well, let's let's just say, like I said before, the city said they put forty thousand dollars into fixing these facilities. Uh, we invested a lot more in these facilities, so um, there is a, a big loss on our end, which we knew going in was going to be the case. You know, whenever you start a new business, you have a, you have a capital investment that you start with that, it's gonna take that again. That's why we started with a five-year agreement. The toughest pill to swallow as far as financial is that this was the summer where we had a lot of those bills and a lot of the lines of credit paid off. This is where we got to the point, year three, if we forecast it correctly, we, we'd, be, um, we'd be doing fine financially, so. so are you still on the hook for eighty thousand dollars in utilities? As far as I know, I am. And that's it's something I agreed to. And can you be more specific in terms of numbers? In, a, in on top of the utility bill, how, how, can you say what other losses you've had? Sure, we have. We still we had uh, a handful of members at the recreation center that we still that paid for annual memberships and. While we haven't been able to refund them yet, I have every intention of refunding every single dollar. It's taking me a little longer. Uh, obviously, when you don't have the facilities, you don't have the revenue coming in, um, we have that. We do have some vendors that we still um, owe some dollars to. Uh, they know the situation, we've let them know. Uh, but again, it's hard when you don't have the revenue coming in. You know, you have to take it from this account and pay to that account. Um, so it, it's. Uh, I won't lie, it's a financial burden on us, and it hasn't been easy. Can you put a number? Six plus figures. More specific? Mid 150. Okay.